Hello everyone and welcome to the first little recap video um, of the year for our Bricklink store called Just a Brick in the Bucket. Um, these videos are going to happen at the end of each month or, or probably the first day of every month. I'm a little bit late on this one, but this is specifically for January of 2020. I'm going to go over kind of the pieces that we sold, you know, the parts that we added, how many orders, uh, what the sales were, um, and everything like that. Um, a little bit of backstory, I guess. Um, we just started our store pretty much at the very, very end of 2019. So we got our first order the last day of 2019. And now we are uh, growing and, and expanding the store and trying to get towards a million pieces. Um, right now we're at just about, we're in, we're in February now, but we're almost at 75,000, I believe. Um, but yeah, we'll go over our January one. So at the beginning of the month, we had 9,735 pieces. And this was these were pieces that I had left over from another, um, I guess, version or another uh, another BrickLink store I was working on doing. Early 2019 um, is about when I stopped doing that specific store, but I hadn't gotten rid of the pieces. So they were still in drawers and stack-ons and stuff, still in an inventory. So I was able to implement those, and those were the first pieces we put in. Um, at the end of the month, you can see we had 63,000 pieces, just over 63,000 pieces. Um, same thing with the lots here. We had just under four hundred, just over four. Or, yeah. Yes, just under four hundred, <laughs> um, and just over fourteen hundred at the end of the month. Meaning we added over fifty-four thousand pieces to our store. Um, <clears throat> also, we had fifteen thousand or fifteen hundred pieces that were sold over the course of seventeen orders during the month. The gross sales for the month, as you can see, were $437, which is pretty good, I think, for the first month being truly open. Um, so each each order was around $25. Um, obviously, they range. We had some $40 orders and some $12 orders, but the average was about $25 or so. Um, this is the number I really want to work on getting up. As you can see, the orders per day is, is 0.55. So, <clears throat> you know, every other day or so, you could say we were getting an order. That's not exactly the way it worked. The, the way it really did work was, you know, I wouldn't get an order for a week, and then we get four orders in in two days or something or three days um, for for January. Um, fans at the beginning of the month we had eleven, which is pretty pretty okay. You know, that was all from the past stuff. At the end of the month we still had eleven fans, so none of these seventeen orders chose to be a fan. Though some of these seventeen orders were people who had previously purchased from our store in past um, iterations, I guess, of the store. So people do come back, apparently, <laughs> which is great. Um, yeah, so look forward to the next one, which is which will be February, obviously. We're really pushing on hitting 100,000 pieces in February, so hopefully we will, we will hit that. Um, yeah, I'm really hoping for that. So thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please put them in the comments section below. I'm going to get back to everyone. I might start a little question series um, of uh, on, on just a brick in the bucket to, to answer some questions about selling on BrickLink. So yeah, thanks for checking it out and have a good one.